can't pronounce it. Uh, in the early days of stock car racing, they decided they were going to put mm. uh, TVs inside of the... Uh, All right, we've got go. this fight okay. ready. Okay. Puck Sorry. is ready to go. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, we are about to and see Robots fight. is ready to go. Let's make some noise, folks. Three, two, one, fight. Okay. Oh, immediately throwing a piece of puck off. Yeah. Trying to get em that. Emperor's, Emperor's weapon is running well. It's just a matter of can you Go get under the wedge to actually Go hit the it. There you go. Win. Got a hit. The mobility looks a little reserved yeah, on the side of the Emperor. Starting to lift the front of the wedge on the Emperor there. Yeah. And here again, the Emperor is made out of a... Another big hit. Piece of debris flying off. And we have the whole front lip of Puck is just lifted up. Yeah, the robot's made out of one of those barrels. Oh, my gosh. On the, on the freeway that protects bridge abutments. So they fill them with sand to absorb the shock. And somebody donated the one to Puck. Puck is another one of the Sierra College robots that we've seen a lot of today. They have a lot of machines in the other room and the other, other categories of competition. And as I mentioned, yeah, he used to be the summer home of the San Francisco 49ers. It looks like Emperor here is having a hard time getting any sort of yeah. motion going, but their weapon's still putting in work. Yeah, the Emperor's got something going on there. He's a little... He's on the berm, but it shouldn't affect him because he has his four wheels, so his front wheels should be on the ground. I'm not sure what's going on with him, but he doesn't. I can't tell. Is he pinned? <laughs> All right, this is pausing the action. Pause for an unstick. We've okay. still got a minute and 21 seconds on this fight. Uh, it's Are we going to create side. some space right now? Is that what's going on? I'm sorry? Are we creating space right now? Uh, Is this an unstick? Unstick, unstick yeah. And it's been a while since we've had an unstick. That's yeah. a good sign, right? And this was robot on robot unstick, not the wall. Uh, yeah, I th yeah, I think you're right. That's right. They were stuck together. We are going to separate them entirely now. That's a great shot of the two robots, two different styles, obviously machines, obviously designed to do something strange that humans no, don't normally do. Yeah. And all the patina on Puck. And googly eye on the Emperor, obviously. You know? Yeah. Yeah. We should have asked him where that name came from, what made him go with Emperor. I think it was Napoleon, a reference to Napoleon. I don't know. It just might be their new groove. Yeah. All right, we've got the okay to restart here. All right, Puck is ready. The Emperor is ready. It's a great shot of the two teams. Three, two, one, and back in it. Emperor is getting a little bit more motion than they got before as we resume. Yep. Weapons looking good, spun up quickly. Nah, he's, he's, he's dragging very something. Very struggling, very much struggling to drive. Oh, you know what's going on? He doesn't have rear-wheel drive. His rear-wheel drive's not on there. He just has the front wheels on. Oh, that, wow. That's different. Some, something must have broken after that first match, and they took out the rear wheels. So that's why he's kind of tipping forward like that, and he's having trouble driving. Yeah. So I wonder if the, the back end of the robot, when it goes back, is, is dry, dragging, and that's what's... That would make sense. Yeah, it's a very yeah. deliberate pace. Still done a good amount of damage yeah, to it's, Puck. It's, start it's starting to look like the sleeping pills are starting to kick in. <laughs> do, do they still sell sleeping pills? I mean, everything's slowing down. Puck doesn't seem real interested in doing much of anything. Yeah, this has been a, a fight on cough syrup. Yeah. 
Got five seconds left. Puck going for a ram and didn't connect. That'll be time. Going to go to a judge's decision. Uh, not as easy as it might look. You know, I mean, Puck still had drive. Emperor didn't. Their weapon was still working. They clearly did more damage. Yeah. I'm thinking maybe Emperor. Um, yeah, I don't know. This, you know, is, th this is going to be very close. And to make the judges job even worse, they're right in front of us listening to us ramble <laughs> Influence on. Like, them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Hey guys, vote for number two. No, the, the damage, I mean, clearly went to Emperor. Oh, yeah. Uh, but, I mean, with the, the speed issues and the drive issues they were having, I can't imagine them getting much in the way of aggression. Yeah, unless if... I mean, it's hard to say unless like, if he suffered some damage and that's what... Because his driving was definitely limited. Yeah, like it, it could have been internal damage. Uh, he's got some funky stuff on the left side on the top. That's fair. And yeah. it might, that might have been pushed into the wheel. Yeah. The, the steel, whoever gave it to him, is incredibly thin. I'm guessing less than an eighth. Yeah. And so that will, I guarantee you that the next robot will not look like that. Yeah. Puck, uh, definitely visually worse for wear yeah but there's more to it than that yeah absolutely no structural damage on that thing now does loss of function count as damage oh absolutely it yeah, does yeah, okay yeah. Oh, so yeah. you can come out of a match looking pristine but not working yeah and still yeah. take all the oh, damage absolutely points. yeah 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 damage doesn't necessarily mean bent metal i mean it's just something that stops working something that has changed on the robot from when it went into the arena yeah and like I've said a bunch, it's not necessarily the most visible damage that's the most effective. I mean, you need to know. We've got the teams being wheeled out here. We do have a judge's decision, though. Puck, Puck oh, is your winner by judge's decision. That's interesting. 19 to 14. Yeah. Huh. Okay.